Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to learn about carbohydrates. Carbohydrates often get a bad rap, especially when it comes to weight gain. But carbohydrates, often called carbs, are not all bad. Because of their many health benefits, carbs have a rightful place in the diet. In fact, the body needs carbs to work well. Understand more about carbohydrates and how to make healthy diet choices. Carbohydrates are a type of macronutrients found in many foods and beverages. Most carbs occur naturally in plant-based foods such as grains. Common sources of naturally occurring carbohydrates include fruits, vegetables, beans, peas and lentils, milk, nuts, grains and seeds. Types of carbohydrates Sugar Sugar is the simplest form of carbohydrates. It occurs naturally in some foods including fruits, vegetables, milk and milk products. Types of sugar include fruit sugar, fructose, table sugar, sucrose and milk sugar, lactose. Added sugar can be found in many foods such as cookies, sugary drinks and candy. Starch Starch is a complex carbohydrate. This means it is made of many sugar units bonded together. Starch occurs naturally in vegetables, grains and cooked dry beans and peas. Fiber Fiber also is a complex carbohydrate. It occurs naturally in fruits, vegetables, whole grains and cooked dry beans and peas. How many carbohydrates do you need? The dietary guidelines for Americans recommend that Carbohydrates make up 45% to 65% of total daily calories. So, if you get 2000 calories per day, between 900 and 1300 calories should be from carbohydrates. That translates to between 225 to 325 grams of carbs each day. Carbohydrates and your health Despite their bad reputation, carbohydrates are vital to your health for many reasons. Providing Energy Carbohydrates are body's main fuel source. During digestion, sugars and starches are broken down into simple sugars. They are then absorbed into the bloodstream where they are known as blood sugar. From there, glucose enters the body's cells with the help of insulin. Glucose is used by the body for energy. Glucose fuels your activities whether it's going for a jog or simply breathing and thinking. Extra glucose is stored in the liver, muscles and other cells for later use or extra glucose is converted to fat. Protecting against disease Some evidence suggests that whole grains and dietary fiber from whole foods help lower your risk of heart disease and stroke. Fiber may also protect against obesity, colon and rectal cancers and type 2 diabetes. Fiber is also essential for optimal digestive health. Controlling weight Evidence shows that eating plenty of fruits, vegetables and whole grains can help you control by helping you feel full on fewer calories. Choose your carbohydrates wisely. Carbohydrates are an essential part of healthy diet and they provide many important nutrients. Still, not all carbs are not equally good for you. So focus on eating fiber rich fruits and vegetables, choose whole grains, Stick to low-fat dairy products, eat more beans, peas, lentils, limit added sugars. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe.